Hey, Miles Beckler here. In this video, we're going to look at the three different ways that you can run Facebook pay per click ads. Uh, the Facebook pay per click ad system is definitely one of my favorite paid marketing systems because it allows me to target my users to retarget my subscribers and people who visit my website and people who have purchased from me. And it also gives me the ability to create lookalike audiences based on those things we just said. So I can create a lookalike based on my um, email subscriber list. I can create a lookalike based on my customers and then display an advertisement to who Facebook thinks looks the most like my people. Now, there's three ways you can start an ad campaign inside of Facebook, and there's only one way I recommend doing, so let's cover that now. We're not going to go through the whole process of creating an ad campaign. It's pretty in-depth, and honestly, I've already covered several of the steps here in uh, my YouTube channel, so go back through the YouTube channel if you want to learn how to make a custom audience. If you don't have your Facebook pixel in place yet, stop where you're at. Literally stop this video right now and go look at my Facebook pixel video because the first thing you have to do is get your Facebook pixel done and then you got to get your custom audiences figured out and your interests figured out we have videos for those so with that said thank you for your patience I'm gonna move myself down here out of the way and we are gonna load up Facebook right so again there's three ways I'm gonna go into one of my kind of like dead test uh, fan pages here to show you the way number one, and this is a never ever do this way of marketing. We've got this promote page button and on the inside of your fan page, when you go to manage your fan page, you'll see these boost posts below every single post you put. Never, ever, ever, ever use the boost post function. It is by far the most profitable um, piece of the marketing pie for them and for you as a marketer it gives you the least control in targeting and that's what this platform's all about is is hyper targeting making sure that your message is getting in front of the people who are most interested in what you have um, I call it stealing your competitors customers so you don't have a way to set that kind of targeting up with the boost post and remember Facebook is a publicly traded company so their ultimate goal is not to make a great experience for you their ultimate goal is to deliver return on investment for their investors and this little button that fan page owners and managers see everywhere is literally the leaky sieve of money they're charging you to get reach because they're crushing your reach on the organic side and they're making you feel like you need to pay them just to get your messages out and the only time we want to get a message out is when it has a high likelihood of generating a lead and a conversion to a customer this is not it so moving right along let's go to number two um, I gotta go back to my personal page here so click the F now number two is this ads manager and this is still the entrance point for both of the next ways um, but right here what loads is indeed the ads manager now when I have active campaigns and we're not in one of my active uh, ad campaigns I, I run a, a number of different ad campaigns up here but when you're in here the statistics that are running through here are fine so if you're just going to look in at your campaigns and see how they're doing this ad manager is fine but they have this create campaign system and it'll take you through and it'll help you create the campaign but again it's not giving you all of the full controls right you need the pro level like the first one we looked at was rookie level the boost post it's for people who don't know what they're doing and they're making a lot of money off of people who don't know what they're doing and they think that's helping number two is people who just come in here to the ads manager they've kind of like graphic used a graphic interface and they make you feel like you have more control which you do but you don't have the level of control you ultimately need to be a professional with this and I'm telling you you got to go pro for from the get-go so how do you do it it's the power editor so it shows up in my frequently used here but if it doesn't show up for you you hover over all tools and then you'll see over here and create and manage it's the power editor so inside of the power editor this is Facebook's tool that gives you all of the bells and whistles that you'll need to create effective campaigns to create split tests on your ads 
to split test your different audience segments, to split test interests and everything. Like you can run a split test of, of male traffic versus female traffic. You can split test uh, women in their 60s versus women in their 50s. There's, there's an infinite number of things you can do inside of this platform. And this is ultimately where you need to be working within. And it all starts with this create campaign functionality. Uh, you can click the plus or you can just kind of like go through. Ultimately here on the left, a quick walkthrough of how this works. These are the three different levels of your ads. There's the campaigns, there's the ad set, and then there's the ads themselves. So the campaign is the container for all of your ads and all of your split tests. The ad set side is where you run your big split tests on your audience level and you enter all of the interests that we captured in one of the previous videos and then here in the ad level is where you create your ads which you also can split test now this is enough for this video we'll be getting into this getting into each of these steps in the future videos so you can see exactly how to do this um, the other thing is power editor runs best in the chrome browser so be sure you're running on google chrome if things aren't working right or if things aren't seeming to load right it's probably a google because you're on like firefox or uh, safari or something so get on google chrome i'm miles beckler i look forward to getting deeper into this facebook pay-per-click world with you it has absolutely revolutionized my business and if you go about it correctly i know it can do the same for you and we will invest some time and invest some money to learn how this works and to learn who our best customers are, and then we just keep putting our ads in front of them. So thank you very much for your time. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. Go ahead and leave me a comment if you have any questions, and uh, subscribe if you want the next videos as they come available. Have a great evening.